Andra, aka Bullhorn Betty, is here at the Warrior's Path waterhole. This is where we are going to actually get into this water and feel what is on the bottom of this lake. I've got some other people here that are participating in this. I believe Dolly Vision is about to pull up, so we're going to wait for him so he can memorialize this. I am going to be taking this camera into the water with me and will be describing what I feel, the temperature of the water and what is on the floor of the water hole here at Warriors Park. This is the last place that uh, Summer was caught on camera other than the um, infamous video of her being on the milk jugs. This is where she was. Uh, when we saw that video taken of her and Hunter. And so we're just going to be getting in here and figuring out what is on the bottom. Are there rocks on the bottom of this? Are there sharp objects on the bottom of this lake? Is there something that Summer Wells could have slipped on June 15th, 2021, when she was out here um, reportedly with Grandis, Candace, and Hunter. We're about to find out. We will get started here shortly. Stay tuned. Bullhorn Betty, we are going into this lake, and I can tell you just walking in at this bank is just disgusting. It's mushy. Uh, there, wait, there was glass here yesterday out here somewhere before the water came up. Be careful. Why would a child be in this water when there's broken glass in it, first of all? And there's bricks, there's leaves. It, oh my god, this is disgusting. It is warmer than I thought it was going to be. Yes, but what do you think about this, this it's, stuff? It's mushy and it's, you almost fall every time you take a step. Oh! This is gross, guys. Let me see if I can turn this around for you guys. Like, under the water here, it's like, ew. Sticks everywhere. Sticks everywhere. Sticks everywhere. There's leaves oh. everywhere. Oh, ow. This does hurt my feet. We're not even halfway out. To We're not even halfway out. out. And you got, ouch, you got shoes on. How are it? It doesn't feel bad with these on, water shoes. And she was, oh my gosh, it stinks she too. Was, she was barefoot. Do you smell that? Yeah. So I'm not feeling any rocks, but there's sticks. a lot of branches, sticks, leaves. This is not good on the pads of the feet. I can tell you that. I can tell you that. Than I thought it was gonna be. It's definitely warmer. Okay. This hurts. Point us which way, guys. Where? Do you guys remember the video? Right here. I think she was further. I'm not going. I'm not going further than this, unless I get my bathing suit on. Is she further that way? I thought. Yeah, I thought she was a little bit on the. I thought she was at this one. Yeah. I think it was out there. All right. Well, I'm gonna have to go get my bathing suit on then. We'll be right back. <laughs> I gotta tell you, walk even walking back up this, this does not feel good on the bottom of your feet. Why in the hell would a kid be out here? Why? I mean, look at this. My feet go in almost a, a foot. In, okay, in and I'm stuck on fishing line right now. <sighs> Hopefully I don't get a hook in there. All right, I gotta go change into bathing suits. I want you to see this, because I'm going to change into a bathing suit so I can go further out in that thing. Look at this. I got dirt rings. Oh, wrong one. Dirt rings up my thigh. Look at that. This whole line right here is not a tan. That is dirt. It is disgusting out here. I gotta say, this is... Why would anybody be swimming in this? I have no earthly idea. I'll leave those down. <laughs> All right, we're going back for round two now that I got a bathing suit bottom on. Oh God, this is so gross. It is, like leaves are coming up. Oh! Okay, so we're gonna make it out. Rocks, giant rocks. Like, Where's the rock? Right here. Like, Let's, hold on. on. Let me look. See. Big rocks. She said there were no rocks in this water. And it's heavy. Yeah. It's heavy, it's not light. Throw it, okay. Just make sure I don't trip. Oh, and the yeah, no, don't trip the on woods. It. I'll probably get down a little bit. All right, all right. So we are back. Let's hope. Ouch. Let's, like this, they. Oh, I feel. I feel string. Yeah. <gasps> 
guys, I don't know if this was, this is, there's a lot of sticks and pokey things and there's a lot of um, uh, fishing line out here. I just dropped off some. We're, we're, we're kind of deep. Yeah, we're really deep. I don't see her. If she was out this far, even if the water wasn't this. What is she, three foot? Yeah. Yeah. It's just, it's so dirty. Look at, look at everything. You can't even see anything. You can't see through it. Remember when Hunter said that she went under and he came and he was sitting there collaring in the water? Like, I'm lifting my leg up. You can barely see it under the water. Okay, it drops off right here. I just went down about two inches. There's no, even if this was receded, there's no way she'd have made it this far. It she, that deep. So she'd be up to her head by there. Yeah. There's something on that okay, stick. Man. I think it's a fishing line. Yeah, this is, this, she didn't come out this deep. I mean, it's up to my waist, like. It's up to my. Yeah, I can see. <laughs> I'm not going that far. <laughs> yeah, you probably get past some sticks, it probably gets really deep. Yeah. But this right here is deep, and I'm telling, and I'm t shit, oh, well, my shirt's wet now. Oh, my shirt's wet. Huh? I'm definitely over it. Yeah. So, guys, I don't know. There was rocks out here, but it doesn't, let me go over here to this stick over here. Huh? So if she was over here, I'm telling you, there's a lot of sticks. I don't know how she was jumping and this would be, this had to have been where she was. This had to have been where she was because this would have been, this would have been way steep for her if it was receded. And, I, and I've got all, I don't know, and all this, this stuff, every time I step, a bunch of bubbles come up all, all over me. This is Coke oh, Rolls. dragonflies mating on my hand. What? <laughs> Don't do that. I'll freak out. This is so gross. This is so gross. This is so gross. And no watch, child. Look at how fast it goes down. Watch, watch me. I'm here. Now watch. One. Hold on. Let me turn this around. Okay. So I'm here. Okay. Yep. I'm standing on the bottom. Now watch how fast. One, two, three, four. And now you're. Four, five, and I ain't going any further. Right. Woo! That's so sick. Did you just get poked in the rear? No, the stick is just. <laughs> I watched too many horror movies. <laughs> I'm gonna need to sanitize and some freaking Clorox. I can tell you that. Okay. Ow! <laughs> that hurt. So, long story short, no child should be out here swimming. Let's just say that. Let's just call it what it is. This is disgusting. I mean, if you're swimming out there, it don't look that bad. Here in the cove looks hard. Okay. It's, it's disgusting. It's disgusting. Ugh. <laughs> it smells. It smells. Smell it's disgusting. Yourself. It smells. Even if she was right there, there are so many sticks and so many things that could have hurt her feet. Because our feet are like my feet are 42 year old feet. They're pretty rough and well they're they're smooth somewhat, but rough. 42 year old feet. Have all junk inside of these shoes. Yeah. So, so tell me, you were out there. Um, what? Describe what you felt. Describe um, your thoughts. Um, I wouldn't ever let any of my kids go in there. Um, I don't particularly ever want to go back in. It it was warmer than I thought. I'll give them that much. But um, the ground. Several times I thought I was going to fall. It's just uneven. Um, there's so many sticks tripping you up. I got stuck on fishing line. And then that big drop. Like, I was fine to my waist, and next thing you know, it's almost to my neck. Right. So, so uh, yeah. a child that's unattended could no could uh, easily go make the wrong step, and uh, something happened. Oh, yeah. She could have easily. I backed up five steps, and I went on, almost went under, like, went right up to my neck. Nope. What about the clarity of the water when you got in? mucky dirty you can just see the dirt all coming up from the bottom and the sand and you cannot see through it you can't you can't see anything mm -hmm. and then what about further out there where you were i did not go that far out w what was it like out there further um it was pretty much the same maybe more sticks i just felt like things kept hitting my ankles and like almost tripping me up yeah and you were um, smart because you brought uh yeah, you I brought my... water shoes right which um, are filled with muck yeah I, I i went i went barefoot and it was right. not comfortable on my feet yeah 
I saw what was down there yesterday when the water was lower. Yeah. And I wouldn't go out there because there was broken glass all over the place. So I was definitely wearing water shoes in. Gotcha. So you, yep. you, when you were out, you said when you were out here yesterday, you saw glass out there? Oh, yeah. Yeah, the water was way, way down. You could see bottoms of like broken bottles. So with that being said, definitely not an environment conducive for a child being in there, let alone a child being in there unattended. Eh, exactly. I would not take my pet in there. I would not let my pet run in there. Okay. Thank you so much. Yep. I have to say I mimic her sentiments exactly. Like I said, I had bare feet on. It was not comfortable for me. I, I stepped on a lot of... Um, Look at my feet. I'll just hope yeah. they are inside of the shoes. Her shoes. This is how dirty her feet were. This is, uh, it's not much cleaner than no, a yeah. foot without shoe. Right. Without right. a shoe. And her, sh and hers and was a sandy and yeah. gross. And... So there you have it, folks. We did go inside the water. It was disgusting. We need to have a bleach bath now. Yeah. And again, a lot of people, because we've heard that uh, Summer Wells and, and Candace didn't, it, let me retract that. Candace did not bathe regularly and some people had thought that this might have been summer's last bath or her bath for the day uh, i don't know that because this water is disgusting and um she would have been really really dirty i'm not sure why um well i can kind of understand why they didn't want the dirty clothes in the truck because this water stinks the further you get into it the more that stuff stirs up the the hor more horrible the smell is out there and um I don't know. I don't know why she was here. I don't know why she was in that water, but I can tell you she went under that water when we heard about Hunter uh, screaming into the water saying, can you, can you um, hear me, Summer? Can you hear me? I understand it now a little better being out there because there's no visibility in that water. It would be hard to see something. When I lifted my leg up, you couldn't see. You could see it six inches and, and two, you know, six inches from the surface. But any further down from six inches to the ground, it was very, very difficult to see what was going on there. Anyways, God bless each and every one of you. Justice for Summer Wells.